When you're looking at options to upgrade your 2014 to 17 GMC Sierra truck, there aren't a ton of really great options. Yeah, you've got little LED bulbs that go in place of the 5202. You can try an HID kit, and then there's a couple, you know, aftermarket clear housings that don't really do a whole lot. In this video, we're gonna talk about probably the best LED fog light upgrade you can do to your truck. Now keep in mind, you don't wanna do an HID conversion kit in your 2014, 15 to 17 Sierra fog light because you'll actually melt the lens. This is what happens when you put even a 35 watt HID kit in this little housing. It can't handle the heat. And that's because the original light bulb is this little tiny 12 to 15 watt 5202 bulb. It doesn't create a whole lot of light and it doesn't create a whole lot of heat. The second you put anything brighter than that, that makes more heat inside this little housing, the plastic lens on the front can't handle it. What we're gonna talk about here are the Morimoto XB LED fog lights. They fit the 2014 and 15 Sierra 1500 with the projector headlights, and they fit the 2015 to 17 Sierra 2500. They also fit some other GMC trucks like the Acadia and the Canyon. They're a really nice product. They look cool, they perform awesome, and they're way brighter than stock. Each fog light is rated at 1,200 lumen. It uses a UV resistant hardened polycarbonate lens with Curia projector style optics. And each light inside uses three high quality Nichia LED chips. The whole design is totally plug and play. You've got the same type of mounting points and adjustment as your old style reflector fog light. And you've got a really nice 5202 style wire connector. Literally pull the old housing out and plug the new one in. On the back side of your original incandescent reflector housing, you've got this little 5202 light bulb. It's not very bright, it's a weird design. Um, and a lot of aftermarket lighting products that are designed to replace this don't fit very well because this is a hard bulb base to duplicate. When you look at the Morimoto LED fog light, you see it's got a really nice uh, 5202 style connector and it plugs into your factory wiring perfectly. On the back side of the housing, you've got the same type of mounting points and the same provision for the adjuster screw. You swap over the adjuster from the old fog light to the new one. You remove the old fog light from the truck and you plug the new one in. You go from that dingy yellow color of the incandescent 5202 fog light to this. It's brighter, wider, and whiter. It's a really amazing upgrade. First, we're gonna show you exactly how to take the old fog lights off your truck and replace them with the new Morimoto XB LED. Then we're gonna show you a beam pattern comparison on the studio behind me so that you can see why you really should be doing this upgrade. Today I'm gonna to show you guys how to remove your factory fog lights from your GMC Sierra and install the Morimoto LED fog lights. So on the back side of the fog light assembly, you're gonna see the wiring for the fog light right here and near that wiring, you're gonna see a black nub with two tabs on it. The first thing you need to do is unplug the fog light wiring to the fog light bulb. Just let that hang out of, the, out of the way for now. And then on that black nub, there's two tabs. You need to press those tabs together and push that nub through the fog light assembly. Like that. Now on the front of the vehicle, You'll see the bottom of the fog lights pushed out a little bit from us pushing that black plastic nub through that hole. There's two points of contact at the top of the fog light. And what you need to do is get a pry tool, preferably a plastic pry tool, go in through the top between the, the shroud and the light itself and just gently pry out. You should feel it pop out of its two little sockets. 
that's all there is to it. So once again, this is the black plastic nub that we pushed through the hole, and that's the, actually the adjuster itself. And these are the plastic nubs at the top. And all you're doing is taking the pry tool, getting between the shroud and this light, and just prying out. You want to use a plastic pry tool for this. You don't want to mar up your nice plastic shroud on your truck. The next step in installing these Morimoto fog lights is the removal of the OEM fog light adjuster from the original fog light. To do that, first make a note of where the threads are, just to try to get it close. It's just much easier to, to get it close and make fine tune adjustments than have it way off in the vehicle. Unscrew the adjuster, just counterclockwise twist this piece here. You'll see the threaded rod come out. Set that off to the side. We need to take this little plastic piece out and to do that, you can take a, a pair of pliers and just reach in here, squeeze the two tabs together and it pops right out. Bring that over to the Morimoto fog light. It'll click right in. There you go. Now thread this in to close to where you had it. It doesn't have to be perfect. You're going to want to fine tune these things when they're on the vehicle against a wall, but I have a pretty good guess as to where it was. And there you go. All right, so in order to install this fog lamp, uh, as you'll see on these ball sockets, I put a little bit of uh, grease on them. It just makes them snap in easier because they really are a tight fit. Uh, and you might need to take it back out to make some adjustments if you're really far off because it's a little bit hard to reach back there and make and, and twist this. You can do it, just it's a little tip, a little idea. So first put the wire harness through the hole and just set the light in there and the light should, for the most part, line itself up. And then you have to push it in there and it's, it's like I said, it's a tight fit. And you'll feel it click. And that's it. Now, the nice part about these lights is not only do they give you an awesome light output on the road, they really look nice on the front end of this truck. I mean, compared to the factory stuff, these are leaps and bounds better. So on the back side of the light, once again, all you have to do is take the new Morimoto harness and connect it to your factory wiring harness. And just line the tabs up. They can only go on one way. Press it together real good. There you have it. You can zip tie the wiring or tuck it behind the bumper support here, whatever works for you. Here's the OEM Halogen Reflector GMC Sierra fog light at 10 feet from the wall. We wanted to do it fairly close so we could give an accurate representation of the beam pattern. Now this low energy 5202 halogen light bulb creates about 600 to 700 lumen of light. And in this test, we measured maximum lux at 10 feet at only 300 lux. It gives us a typical fog light beam pattern. It's doing its job, but it's dingy yellow. It's not very large. Let's see what happens when we change it out for the Morimoto XB LED fog light. The Morimoto XB LED fog light at the exact same position from the wall using the same voltage creates 560 maximum lux. That's not quite double the output, but it's close. But look at this beam pattern. How awesome is this? I would love to have two of these on the front of my vehicle. Not only does the fog light itself look cooler, but they're brighter with better color and better beam pattern. Not only are these new fog lights really cool looking, but obviously you get a way better performance from your fog lights. This will make your fog lights more usable. They've got a great warranty. They're DOT approved and super easy to install. Click the link in the description below the video so you can find this product for your truck at our website at www.headlightrevolution.com. Thanks for watching.